our gospel started with a certain festival celebration of the Jewish. And the festival of dedication was a celebration of life. And it says, it was winter. This celebration is called Hanukkah in, in Hebrew. It's just like season of Christmas for us, wherein we have our Christmas lights. So, it was a celebration of life, but the Jewish, the Jew, they choose to stay in the dark. In the dark because they refuse to believe in Jesus. And the reason of this disbelief, the gospel says, they are not among his sheep. And Jesus said, my sheep hear my voice, I know them, and they follow me. They follow me. You know what? To follow is not easy. Why? Because we need to listen. When you follow someone, you need to listen. That's what obedience is all about. To listen. In today's gospel, the Jews did not believe on Jesus for two reasons. Number one, they are not listening. And you know what, my parishioners? It's very difficult to convince someone who are not listening. It's hard to persuade people who don't like to listen. But in our first reading, this is what I call the, the golden growth of uh, the Christianity. Because even if they are persecuted, even the presence of persecution, it doesn't stop them to evangelize, to tell people to believe that Jesus is the Son of God. But here, in our Gospel, Jesus is telling them that I am the Son of God. The Father and I is one. But still, they refuse to believe. They refuse to believe because they were not his sheep. They don't belong to the flock. And if we listen to God, the promise is very beautiful. And he said, I give them eternal life. You will never perish. Nobody can snatch you from the hand of God. You know what? It is difficult and hard to convince those who don't belong to your flock. That's why today we celebrate the feast day of uh, Saint Athanasius, doctor of the church. He was the great defender of the divinity of Christ. And it's against Arius because Arius is saying that Jesus is not divine. He is saying that Jesus is just an ordinary man, but he's just like a superman, a super being, but he is not God. But Arius, I mean Athanasius, defended the faith. And here in our gospel, Jesus himself said, the Father and I are one. The challenge this morning is this. We are challenged to listen and to believe. Why? Because eternal life is reserved only for those who believe. Eternal life is not difficult for those who are listening. <laughs> Nowadays, there are so many disciples of Arius who don't believe in the divinity of Jesus. Like Athanasius, let us defend our faith by listening, following, and believing in Jesus, the Son of God.